Hello YouTube, this is Gogster, your friendly cynic neighbor. For more than 20 years I worked as a logistic engineer in water and in food supply, mostly in Africa. I want only to please make you think that you have the responsibility when you give to someone, when you make a donation. Don't make a donation only to have a good conscience, to feel better, but follow up to whom you give your donation. First, how many percent of the money you donate arrive to destination? How many percent is used to pay chairmen of certain companies who pay a heavy infrastructure or administration of certain companies? Second, which material is built up down there? Will it be some heavy pumps working with fuel? Will they work with oil, gas or with solar energy? or only added manual pumps. In my opinion only manual pumps work because there is no money for fuel and there is no money for spare parts if something breaks on these pumps and there are no engineers left on place to fix something when something is broken. 3A Where these water pumps gonna be built in some areas, some regions you're gonna save 300 lives by building a water pump but you will kill 3000 people in the next generation because there will be no more water to pump 3b on which land these pumps will be built the landlord on which land the pump will be built will claim money from the people to take the water. 3C The neighbor tribe or clan or village will fight, will make war to access also this water pump. If there is not a plan in this region to build further pumps to make an equal access for every neighbor. For and last, make sure that to access clean water, people don't have to join a defined political party or religion to be allowed to take this water. I will not tell you which are the good companies and the bad companies. I will only ask you to be skeptic and to try always to find out what is behind the company to whom you make your donations. I gave you only some criteria, so please make sure that with your donation you make not more harm than good. Goodbye.